It's Rowena List, professional organizer and speaker of gettingittogether.ca, coming to you from Vancouver, British Columbia. Today I'd like to chat with you a little bit about organizing your closet. Now it could be a hall closet like this one that's for the vacuum and cleaning supplies, or it could be a clothes closet or um, you know a shoe closet, whatever type of a closet. But today we're going to talk about the hall closet where you keep your vacuum. And we're fortunate enough to have a vacuum system, and so we've got the cord in here, the, the hose all wrapped up. But there is room in this closet if you do have a conventional type of vacuum cleaner. You could fit that in here as well. Uh, a step stool, because those are always handy, especially if you have some high places that you need to reach for cleaning or getting things out of cupboards. And there's room for an ironing board. You could even, if you wanted to, hook this up. Uh, this particular closet, this wall is solid plaster, so we can't put anything in here, but you could have a hook in here. And then there's also room back here for your broom and mop. So you can see that if you keep things to a limit, that's a key word, keep things to a limit and you can fit everything nice and neat and organized in here. Here's all your extra parts for your vacuum cleaner and your ironing uh, iron goes up here. Now you can see there's some extra spare room and that's okay to have empty space in a closet, it really is. But what would be a great place for, uh, for things in here would be those reusable cloth bags if you had quite a few of those. Know your limit on those cloth bags though because they really can just multiply and take over any storage area. I highly recommend about two reusable cloth bags per family member that you have. And of course, they're constantly going back and forth, maybe from your car or to your work or to school or whatever, and then when you're wanting to store them, you could store them in here. For more helpful tips, please visit my website at gettingittogether.ca.